Hey my honey bunches, welcome back to Bougie Bites with Honey. Today guys, we have a quick snack. We are doing a review, because this is my first time, on the hot Cheeto fried pickles and I have some king crab and some yummy mayo dip that I made the other day. So I feel like I gotta copy Shay Snacks and say let's snack y'all, because it's not a smash, it's just a quick little sample. <laughs> All right y'all, let's smash. I'm hungry, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to y'all, but hold on, this is a piece of king crab. But let me give y'all a big piece. Y'all want that first bite? So I made these in my air fryer for the first time. Ooh, my mouth watering. Want that bite? Please, Lord, let this be good. Lord Jesus, I will never play on camera, pray on camera. But please, Father, I beg of you, let this be good. Y'all, when I tell y'all I season this so perfectly. Mm, mm, mm. It's still hot too. Yes. So. I know it don't look like much. And it's kind of on the Cajun side. <laughs> Tastes like a giant fish steak. <clears throat> I'm going to make this again tomorrow off camera. Now that I know what we're working with. So y'all, mm, hey when that part is in there. Where do we begin? <laughs> mm, 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 mm. Have y'all tried this yet? I know I'm late. But this king crab hit different, so I added mm, mm, mm. I blended up the hot cheeto. Then I added some um, King Crab ATL seasoning and Old Bay to the hot cheeto and then re-blended it again. Y'all, this seasoning is unbelievable right now. Mm. This is truly amazing. And I was worried because <clears throat> I was the first time using my new air fryer. I've been bought it, the Cuisinart air fryer, but I kept pressing it in. It was worth the wait. Mm-mm-mm. Okay, then let me tell y'all what happened. Why they got a little Cajun. I had a mint, y'all. Now you bite something real small so you can laugh, make it last. <laughs> Mm-mm-mm. Dang, my sister left too soon. And this mayo dip is the same mayo that I had on, I think, Monday's video. So it's been sitting and marinating. Oh, my God. I don't remember what's in it. You'll have to watch Monday. <laughs> Go back and watch that video. What's I about to tell y'all? I have some three cheese ranch. I used to love this back in the day when I was in college. I didn't know they still made it. I'm going to just squirt some out back here. Okay, let's get another piece of king crab. I cannot wait to wake up and eat this again tomorrow. Mm -mm -mm. So yeah, normally when I'm doing my mukbangs and it's during the week, and not on the weekend, well, either way, my son is usually outside playing with his little friends, right? And I'm sorry, on Monday's video, or oh, Wednesday's video, I can't remember, but they were mad loud. Because they play soccer right here in my backyard. But, today is a school night. It's Monday for me, y'all. Happy Friday to y'all. Um, let me get this king crab one more time. Did I try the ranch? Let's try it. Mmm. Mm -mm. Yeah, so it's a school night. So I'm like, yeah, you can go play while I get ready for my video, but don't you come home late? Usually he takes a watch. 
I don't let him take the phone because I'm afraid he may break it. While he's playing, just know that boys, they play rough, rough. Y'all, that street light came on. Y'all know where I'm going with this. Y'all know. Comment below if y'all were able to come outside after that street light went off. Mind you, he's in second grade. All right, let's try these pickles. I don't know how I feel about them. We'll see in a second. Which one? The ranch. Lord, please let this be good. That's why I didn't make a lot. <laughs> Tastes like seafood. It don't taste like pickles because of my seasoning. This is good though. Falling apart. Yeah, so he's grounded. I went outside like the mama that you don't want to see with the bathrobe and the bonnet. <laughs> I sure did. Mm. Let me tell y'all a quick little story. I thought it was funny. So, Saturday when I was filming for y'all for Monday's video, again, they were outside playing in the backyard. Let's get this knuckle. And with the knuckle, excuse me. So I'm outside, they're outside while I'm filming. Mm, mm, mm. So I'm cleaning up. Usually when I'm not filming, I wash my hair, put my hair in the bonnet. Maybe I'll put like a robe on after I take off whatever, excuse me, take off whatever top I have on because y'all know I don't like them little bottoms on. It just depends on if I have some place to be afterwards. Saturday, I did not. I stayed home and I worked somewhere. So, I go outside because I'm hearing all the banging and yelling and screaming. My son and his little friends, they're like 10 kids deep. Then I lost their minds and found Some long wooden sticks that had like nails coming out of it. And they're dragging them through the neighborhood. Mind you, I don't live in that type of neighborhood where this should go on. <laughs> I say this for a reason. Hold on, bear with me. So I'm thinking they done lost their mind. Then they're banging it against the street lamp. That was the loud noise I was hearing. So I stick my head out of my robe and my body. I was like, what do y'all think y'all doing? And I yell at all of them. If you're friends with my kids, I'm yelling at your kids. <laughs> Y'all, you know, the oldest of the crew was like, there's a man, he's kidnapping kids and throwing them in a the van, which that was on the news. So we got to protect ourselves and they're going on and on. Muddy head to toe. Let me put that in there. How they got covered in mud, I don't know. So I'm yelling at them. Y'all, why I look to my left, the agent, <laughs> a real estate agent two doors down was trying to sell a house. <laughs> I really had to lie. You had to be in the moment to get it. It was this nice family, husband, wife, baby was still in her arms. So it was a small baby. And all they see is these kids with weapons dragging down the street, covered in filthy mud. And the agent was looking at me with that look. And I felt bad because I looked tore the heck up. And he was like, all I heard him tell her was, so are you guys going to go with your preferred lender? And the lady was, the husband was like, we'll give you a call. Honey, they hopped in that car so fast and pulled off. <laughs> I don't think he's selling that house today. Saturday. Mm-mm. I felt so bad for him. He sped off right behind him. It is what it is. But that's the time you should buy a house when the kids are out playing. That way you know what you're really getting. <laughs> I was so embarrassed for myself, but all I could do was laugh. Like, oh, wow. Well, it is what it is. Let's get something else, y'all. I cannot believe how good this is. 
I'm really bugging. Mm-mm-mm. As you can see, I'm favoring the king crab more than the pickles. This is another big piece of knuckle. Another king crab. I'm about to smash both of them. No, both of them. <laughs> I know y'all seen that little cat meme. Y'all want that bite? <coughs> Sorry. Mm. I see B-Love put out a 24 leg challenge today. No. I'm sorry, 20 leg challenge. Not that that's any easier. I don't know if I should do it. If I do it, it won't be fried chicken. Mm -mm -mm. Lord, you're so good to me. So, I never even explained why the darn thing burned, did I? I kept going. I'm sorry, y'all. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-mm. Mm. Yeah, so by the time I got my kid in the house, which I had just told y'all, he's not a bad kid. So I felt so bad telling him he's grounded, but you gotta lay down the law. And then my sister came over. She went and bought me a Christmas tree. Told y'all I was not in the Christmas spirit this year. So I guess I have to be now. Because her tree's been out. <laughs> she didn't wait no time. I might insert a pic right here. Yeah. So we'll put mine up this weekend. I'll let them decorate the front porch. I thought that once I started buying stuff, the feeling would kick in. Mm-mm. Mm. -mm. mm. should have some cheese sticks, too. Dang it. But I'm hot Cheeto out. No more. And it's spicy. I think I'm finished. I got my experience. Mm -mm -mm. Man, I should have left somebody a bite. <laughs> mm. This is delicious. I'll make them some tomorrow. So yeah, now I'm in this part where I gotta make up toys or something to buy. Every year I go crazy. Gifts all past the tree, like spread out. Piles and piles of gifts. I promise you, I just don't know what else to buy. I think the kid said he wanted a gaming laptop. So I'll get that. He's getting a little too big for his scooter, so I'll probably buy him a new scooter. Excuse me. Excuse me. So I know now they make them a bit fancier where they're like electric and they can convert to like a, a ride-on bike type thing and a scooter to on one. Outside of that, I don't know what to buy him. And he don't know what he want. So... Mm -hmm. Yeah, the pickles were okay. They're not life changing. I may try them again tomorrow, but nothing life changing. But, um, I will say to me, this just tastes like crawfish steaks. Mm -mm. Look at that, y'all. I'm so hyped. This is what makes me smile. I promise y'all. Food. I wonder how healthy this was. I mean, it's not like I fried it, fried it. I just put it in the air fryer. 
I sprayed some um, olive oil Pam over it. And that was it. Mm. I'll let y'all go. I'm shrink this video down. Hope you guys have an amazing weekend. Do something fun. Do something good. Make somebody else smile. All of that good stuff. I know food all in my teeth. I feel it. I'm going to see you guys on Monday.